this is our holiday. We've finished now. This is, we're going to go and get the plane in what? Half hour? Half hour, yeah. Half hour, we're leaving Kirsty's house and we're going to go take the, take the car back, get the shuttle to the airport and check in. But I've had a really good time, I don't know about you. Wicked time, absolutely marvellous. Um, starting off with Australia, uh, fantastic time over there. Uh, had an excellent time in Sydney for the week, including Australia Day. That's life. That's life. That's what people say. You're riding high on April and you're shut down in me. But I know I'm gonna change that tune when I'm back on top, back on top in June. I say. Tours around the Opera House. Bridge climb, days out, Bondi, Manly, uh, going out to Narrabeen. Bondi, out fantastic <laughs> surfing. <laughs> I, 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 I'm not ashamed to say that we were completely rubbish. Rubbish. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely rubbish. Uh, yeah, there was the, the kayaking worlds as well too, uh, which was awesome. Yeah, I really wicked. have to say it was yeah. the most fantastic paddling I've ever seen. Better than that. Yeah. Um, after after Sydney and picking up a few more um, waves and strays, as we seem to have done this entire yeah. trip, <laughs> yeah. uh, we flew off to uh, Uralu, Ayers Rock, and stayed there for a few days. We did the walk around the bottom of it, and we did uh, Katajunga, which I can now pronounce. Katajunga. <laughs> 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 and then Kings Canyon and we managed to cook our own food too which was um, unexpected but kind of cool yeah moving on from there we uh, went on to Cairns then up to Port Douglas a uh, bit of splashing around the Great Barrier Reef a couple of good shots of uh, Nemo and his friends um, followed up by a day out with Gary uh, <laughs> oh, the on, Gary. ever so enthusiastic uh, tour guide who we <laughs> No, now know knows absolutely everything there is to know about flora and fauna in uh, Australia. What a marvellous, marvellous man. And also he holds the record for the most amount of people in his house for a sleepover with his daughter. Absolutely, yeah. 14. 14. So, Amazing. Well done, Amazing. that man. Paul Douglas didn't know there was that many kids there. <laughs> exactly. Didn't uh, see that many kids. <laughs> didn't see that many kids. Uh, they kept in small boxes. So yeah. Then we, we came and flew out here to New Zealand. And we've spent well, a few days sort of crashing around Kirsty's house where we are, uh, we're about to leave. Took a drive up to the Northlands, drive around there. Uh, had a look at some really big trees. Massive trees. Yeah, a look around the Bay of Islands. Very nice. Then took a drive down to the middle of the North Island, where we did um, the walk. Uh, Tangariro, uh, the crossing, I believe it's called. Yep. Saw, um, saw Mount Doom from Lord of the Rings films, which um, I'm not going to pronounce his real name, because I can't. And we drove back yesterday. Had a fantastic pizza last night. Good pizza. Good yeah. Lasagna. yeah, very nice stuff. And um, here we are, about to go. But uh, I'd like to say uh, thanks to Gareth for being a fantastic travelling companion. I'd like to say thanks for, to Toby for the same, but I can't. No, I can't, no, he's joking. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a fantastic trip, Thank had you. a really good time. I'm about to go and kill Gareth. <laughs> and um, here's, uh, here's Toby and Gareth signing out. See you later. <laughs>